I'm a chibi now, yay! <laughs> well, hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today, we'll be talking about Genuine, or more specifically, how even though Akron gonna power creep Genuine as the best electro DPS in the game, that doesn't really matter. And I should probably explain what I mean. Because like we all know Akron, we already saw her kit reveal things like Braxophone and I Went to Lose showing gameplay of Witchy. And as I thought, she is very strong. Like it kind of an L that so much of a damage locked behind her light cone. And realistically, she only has like two options being the wealth light cone and good night sleep well. But other than that, she looks really strong. Like she easily gonna be like one of the best MOC DPS in the game. And by the fall, genuine got power creep again. Like Damn, bro can't catch a break, am I right? <laughs> and like even though Gen 1 gonna get power creep again, that doesn't really matter because for one, it's a very casual PvE game. Like you can make any character work as long as you build them properly, have a team around them, get them a really good light cone, and you can beat everything in the game because even though it may take a while to get those weaker units up compared to like the premium DPS units, like a character like Gen 1 who not that powerful as the premium staple DPS units, but the amount of times I shown how genuine can get the job done over and over again, how it can still get good clears in MOC. And like in the gameplay you see here, this MOC when I did, I got a tree clear on the first side. And now that I finally build up my sparkle properly, my genuine feels so much better to play. But also at the same time, I said this once, I said it twice, I know Akron will beat out genuine MOC, but in pure fiction, that's a whole different story. Because I think Akron will be like a decent unit in pure fiction but genuine like by far like the best electro unit for pure fiction just because the amount of aoe genuine has and obviously akron will still be like a more desirable pick because she's hot white hair when she transforms so sorry genuine again <laughs> i'm gonna be like a very strong dps but if you like genuine he can still work in pure fiction and still get respectable clear times in moc like genuine not gonna get like the fastest clear time compared to like akron Run. Like let's say Akron get like a 1 or 2 clear and Genuine got between like a 5 to 3 clear. Yeah, Akron got better clear time than Genuine. That's the obvious thing, right? But the thing about Genuine clear time, those clears he does are still very good. Like a 3 and 4 clear is still very respectable. And a 5 clear is still very solid. Since you have to beat MOC in under 10 cycle, beating in 5 turns is like the bare minimum. Or do you like the benchmark what you need to like if you're trying to go for like 3 stars or unless you have really powerful character that can give you like three or four clears so you can have like six or seven clears left for the second side but i think you guys understand the point i'm trying to make with genuine like in every single new genuine video i made i always said in moc akron will be better than genuine i always said that but also what i showed in those videos as well that genuine can still put up a fight and in every run i showed i showed how genuine is still very capable of clearing the content in the game like i understand there are going to be more and more characters coming out that when it's a part of Genu 1. Like Genu 1 was the second limited 5 star to get dropped at launch. And since the game can't really keep depending on hype, they keep upscaling the newer units higher and higher and higher and higher to like a ridiculous amount of levels. To be legit, every new limited 5 star unit just assumed to be better and better, and even more broken and more quality of life features to have. Like if you compare Genu 1 to like the premium DPS unit, yeah, you're gonna feel lackluster. Because the thing with Genu 1, Genu 1 is good but the other premium dps are just fucking broken like obviously he's gonna get power crap hell he even got power crap by kafka a freaking dot driver but yet with all the power creep that happening to genuine all the cracks that keep upscaling higher and higher genuine still holds up pretty well i am pure fiction he really shines a lot like i said this once i said it twice i'll keep saying it over and over again if you build genuine properly get a team around them get a light cone build them up he can perform like a plain and simple but the thing about genuine right if your relic quality is bad genuine will feel clunky to play but then he does get better with you like sparkle because sparkle and genuine like a godsend like that really fixes like the speed problem genuine have with getting turned for building up like the lord stacks but if you don't have sparkle you know like asta or hanya can really help genuine a lot because that speed is so valuable for him because if you have any of those units i said like you can really focus on genuine crit and crit down 
damage basically to where you can make like not really high multiplied hit like a freaking freak train like even if akron better same time genuine pure fiction if you like genuine enough he can work in moc so for like all my king you want enjoyers even if akron power creep genuine that'll be okay because if you like genuine you can make him work and not yet if you like a unit enough you can make them work like genuine can still beat all the content in game along as they weak to electric like all you have to do is invest in your stocks but hey that's just an opinion my opinion <laughs> and yeah that's about it because with all that said i think that everything i will talk about for today's video so thanks for watching i do appreciate you for sure and let me know what i should do next and let me know what you guys think what to say you agree with me or you disagree let me know down below because at the end of the day i'm not gonna kill you meh i probably might kill you, but at the same time, still comment and wait quite a lot of that stuff. But anyway, final thought is, yeah, in MOC, Akron is gonna be such a powerful DPS for MOC. But genuine will still hang in there because one, if you just like a character enough, you can make them work. Because this is a casual PvE game. If this was a PvP competitive game, I'll keep it a fast tag. That would have been a GG for homeboy. <laughs> and yeah, that's about it. Make sure to subscribe to my channel because I post daily videos every single day and follow me on twitter or x or whatever the hell you want to call it and join my discord server and be a part of my community because it'll make me a happy boy for sure <laughs> and with all that said take care love you guys and i'll see you on the next video goodbye Nostalgia vibe. That's your bitch ass.